All right, he's a musician, a dancer, an actor, a singer. It goes on and on and on and on. Yeah. But he might best known, be best known for his portrayal of Kyle Barker in the hit sitcom Living Single. C.C. Carson returns to Chicago with a night of soul and jazz at the City Winery, and he's back with us here yes. on Daytime yes. Chicago. Good to see you. Good to see you as well. Happy New Year Happy to you. Happy New all. Year. You have been busy in the last year. Yeah. And congratulations on your Image Award that you were just nominated for. Thank you so much. Amazing. Thank you so much. And Oh, sorry, go ahead. Yeah, tell, tell us what you're up to. So, uh, well, we got so many things happening. Uh, we're working on uh, the show we talked about last year, uh, the cooking, late night cooking show. We're yes. in pre-production for that, so that should be out this spring. We're hoping to be able to sell that um, by spring. Are you cooking, or are you just talking to people as they cook? No, um, we're doing both. Okay, okay. I like we're that. Doing both. Love we're a doing man both. in the kitchen. Yeah, oh, okay. yeah, but it really is about... Um, I realized that COVID really ravaged our community bad because a lot of it is because we don't eat well. Yes. Yeah. And so to show people that you can make food as fast as you can go out and get food. Oh, mm -hmm. that's and kind of like what Chef Cameron was talking about yeah. earlier. Exactly, exactly, exactly. So you can cook at home, have, be healthier, know what's in your food, and not have all the extra stuff that preserves your food when you eat out. Okay. Well, yeah. you're doing this. I also understand you're doing some stuff with CPS to get music back to kids. Absolutely. We're, we're really working to get a music program back into the public schools. So important. And I'm asking my celebrity friends and basketball players and football players to really look into that and see if you can help to fund the money for a, a program for a school in your neighborhood. Is that really how you got started through school, getting in? in, in Absolutely, in, I would not be here in, without the Title VI program. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the Title VI program brought music and theater and dance to my a grade school. Okay. And that's what gave me the bug to be the artist I am today. Wow. And that great voice, I oh, love just listening to music. Yeah. <laughs> we're going to hear you in a minute, uh, but what are you? Are you doing something different than you did last year when you were at the City Ride Week? Well, we always try to do. Um, put something new in, something different in, so when somebody comes by, out to see me a second time, okay. they don't get the exact same show. Oh, okay. we like oh, yeah. that. So you get a chance That's, to see a little yeah. different thing. Yeah. It's kind of like what you're feeling. I, I think yeah. that's what exactly. you say before, yeah. whatever is moving you at the moment. Exactly, and that's why I like jazz, because it gives you the most space. Oh, it yeah. gives you the most creative license to, to explore. Oh, oh my gosh, I love that. And, and uh, what other projects are you working on that we can expect in the upcoming year? Well, we're looking to go into the studio within this first quarter, so hopefully okay. by summer we'll have a new CD project out as Ooh, well. Okay. Uh, I, I can't talk about that okay. show right okay. now because right. we haven't finished that, but there's some other stuff coming up uh, that you'll be able to see I'm me so in. I'm so happy I to know. see you're busy. Yeah, I love oh, it. You. You're yes. staying active and you're working on another show. I mean, it's so exciting. It's, well, you guys can see them tonight at City Winery. The doors open at 6 p.m. Uh, citywinery.com where you can get the information on tickets. TC, thank you.